and welcome back to another video. So in today's video I am going to be showing you a spring pastel eyeshadow look. So I've already done my base so I'm going to get straight in with the eyeshadows. I thought because you know the weather's brightening up and today the skies are so blue it's really nice and warm outside so I thought why not kick off spring with a little spring eyeshadow look. So the eyeshadow palette I'm going to use, I'm just going to do out of one eyeshadow palette and it's this Makeup Revolution Roxaurus Colour Burst palette. So I'm probably going to use a mix of these ones here. I'll use the yellow, purple, pink. I'm not sure whether to use the green or not but definitely the blue. And we're going to try and make a pastel spring makeup look. So the first thing I'm going to do is use the Revolution Concealer. So it's Conceal and Define. This is in the shade 8.5. I'm going to use this just to prime my eyelids so that the eyeshadows come out a lot more vivid and the colours a lot fuller. So let's just bring you in a bit closer so you can actually see my eyes. Right, so we're going to put a little bit of this on here, a little bit of this on here. I'm going to use this little brush to pat that all in. Okay, so the first eye will look like that. And we'll do the second eye. Okay, so the eyelids are all primed, ready, so we're going to go in with some eyeshadow. I'm going to start off with the pink, which is called Fetch. I'm just going to take a little bit on my brush. I'm going to start with that bit in the inner corner of the eye and I'm literally just pressing it in. You see it comes out very vivid now that I've got the concealer on there. Put it up so it goes just above the socket. There we go. Should be fine. And then we're going to go the same on the other side. So the next colour I think I'm going to go for is the blue, this one here. So this one is called Blue Lagoon. So I'll take a clean brush for that one just so we don't get any of the colours mixed up. So going for a bit of the Blue Lagoon on here. I absolutely love Makeup Revolution eyeshadows. They're so, so affordable, but actually really good quality. Like they come out really nicely. Okay, so the pink and the blue done. Um, next, I think I'm going to go for the yellow shade, which is Lemonade. I haven't tried this yellow colour yet, and I'm not sure. There we go. It's actually not coming out too bad. I can't really see it on the camera. It is coming out. I just have to press a little more on for the yellow. Yeah, there we go. You see it's coming out there? Okay, so the next colour I'm going to do, I'm going to, hmm, I might see if I can squeeze a little bit of green along here and then we'll go for the purple on the outer. I'm going to go for this green here, which is Dinosaur. I love the names of these colours. So we're going to put a little bit of green just here. It's probably going to blend in quite a lot with the yellow and make yeah, you can't really tell the difference between the two right now, but I haven't left much space either. So now on the very edges, we're going to go in with this purple here, which is lavender. And we'll put a bit on this side as well. So that purple doesn't seem to be coming out as well as the other colours. So I'm going to take some of my iconic prep set and glow and I'm going to spray that directly onto the brush and then it gives the brush a bit of moisture to hold onto the product a bit more. I mean you don't want it to be soaking wet because you don't want to get the product too wet but it should then come out a bit stronger. You see it's sort of showing up a bit more now. There we go, that's all the colours on then. So now I'm going to take a fluffy brush. This is the Spectrum B07. And I'm just going to blend in all them colours so they don't look so bulky, especially up the top. And then we'll just blend in slightly the joins. 
You don't want to blend them too much so it becomes like one. But we do just want to blend it in so it looks a bit softer. There we go, that one seems to blend nicely. So can you see the difference between the two? This one's all blended and soft now and then this one's still a bit blocky. So now we'll do the other side. This is a great look for hopefully festivals if we can all start doing that sort of thing again or even just a fun summer party. Right, so that's that. I'm just going to brush away any pouring product underneath. And now I'm going to add a little bit underneath just to sort of bring it all together. So I'm going to take the brush that I used for the pink I'm going to get a little bit of that and pop that just under my lash line here. And then I'm going to grab the one I used for the blue and put that in the middle. And then we shall take the yellow one, I think. And then I'll just take that purple and just go over the very end to bring that bit together. So that goes around the outside of the eye. And then we'll go over with the blending brush again. Blend in that bit around the outside there so it's not so bulky, we'll just blend that in and then we'll just quickly blend in the underneath like this. There we go. So I'm going to go and put a little bit of liquid eyeliner on and mascara and then I shall come back in a moment to show you the finished look. And here we are, this is the finished look. A nice spring colourful eyeshadow look that you can use for parties, for festivals or just for every day if you want to brighten up your everyday look. So I really hope you enjoyed watching me create this pastel spring eye look. If you did enjoy the video please do give it a massive thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe as well and hit that notification bell if you want to be the first to know when I upload a new video. Please also let me know in the comments if you did enjoy this video and if you want me to create any more makeup or eyeshadow looks. But thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you in my next video. Bye bye!